Good morning, my dear students. How are you today? Our lesson today is lesson 13.3. Write a numerical expression. It's a very easy lesson. Today we are going to learn how to translate an expression, a word expression, into mathematical expression or number expression. Let's start our exercise to understand this lesson. Here we have write a numerical expression for each calculation. Here we have a word problem and just I need to translate it. Just to translate it. Add 8 and 7. Add means plus. Add means a plus. So I'm going to add 8 plus 7. And then, if you have the word then, so you have to put this expression inside a bracket like that. So, and then multiply by 2. So, write multiply by 2. So, again, add 8 and 7. Add means a plus. 8 plus 7. And then, then you have to put bracket to include 8 and 7. Then multiply by two. Another exercise. Find treble the difference. If you have treble the difference, this word treble the difference means three times open bracket. You have to open bracket and put inside the bracket minus because it's a difference. So treble the difference three times the bracket minus. Treble the difference again three times bracket minus. Treble the difference means three times bracket and put minus. If you have treble the sum, treble the sum. So three times bracket plus. Treble the sum three times bracket plus. Twice the difference, twice the difference. So two times bracket minus. Twice difference, it will be like that. Two times bracket and the inside bracket minus. If you have twice the sum, so two bra times bracket and the inside the bracket plus because sum means a plus. So let's back to our exercise. Treble the difference means three times bracket minus. Treble the difference between what and what? Between 44.75 and 22.8. So write 44 here, point 75 minus 22.8. The next one. Here we have multiply four times seven over eight. Four times seven over eight. So you have to multiply four times seven over eight then and then so you have to put bracket to include four and seven over eight then add 12 add means a plus so after that plus 12 like that here number six add 49 to the quotient add means a plus 49, so 49 plus, because add 49, 2 means 49 plus. To the quotient, quotient means divide. Quotient means divide. So you have to put bracket first. Quotient of 125 and the 5. Quotient means divide. So 125. 
divided by 5. So again, add means plus, add 49 to something. So 49 plus, the other one is to the quotient of 125 and the 5. So both bracket, quotient means divide, 125 divided by 5. Here number two, show how to use a property to write an equivalent. Equivalent means equals. An equivalent expression for nine times bracket seven plus 44. How we can write an equivalent expression for this? You are going to multiply nine by seven first. So it will be like that, nine times seven. Put it inside a bracket, drop the plus, and nine again times 44. So it will be nine times seven is the first time, second time nine times 44 like that it will be nine times 44 so we we'll distribute nine <clears throat> among this bracket nine by seven first and nine again multiply by 44. let's see exercise number seven Write a numerical expression. Write a numerical expression for each calculation. Add 91 and 129 and 16. So you have to add them first, like that. 91 plus 129 plus 16. And then you have the word then. So you have to put bracket, then divide by 44. So it will be divided by 44, like that. Number eight, 8.5 times the difference, times the difference. It will be like that, 8.5 first, times the difference you have to open bracket and bot minus and the bot minus because it's a difference so 8.5 times the difference difference between what and what 77 and 13 yes the next one subtract subtract means minus 55 from the sum Subtract means minus, okay? The number which after from is the first. After from is the first. So you have to put 55 here. Because the number after from is the first. From the sum. Sum means a plus. Sum means a plus. So you have to make here in the first part, 234 plus 8, and put them inside a bracket. Again, subtract means minus. 55 from, the words from, the number after from will be the first. So 55 will be here in the second part. From the sum, sum means a plus. Sum of what? 234 and 8. So 234 plus 8 first inside the bracket. <clears throat> Multiply 2 third by 42. So it will be like that. 2 over 3 multiply by 42. The first step. And then, then you have to both bracket to in include 2 third times 42. Then multiply that product by 10. So multiply by 10. 
Organic is two one. Number eleven. Write an expression to show the calculation you could use to determine the total area of the rectangles at the right. I need to find the total area of this rectangle, of this three rectangle. As we know that area of rectangle is length by one. Area of rectangle is length by one. So I have 18 times 22. This is the first rectangle. 18 times 22. Inside bracket. Total means a plus. So plus again. The same rectangle of the second rectangle. Again, 18 also times 22. Plus the third rectangle will be also 18 times 22. This is the total area of this rectangle. You can write it by another way. Find the area of one rectangle only. 18 times 22. This is the area of one rectangle. And because of they are the same, the same length and same width. So it will be multiply by three because we have three rectangles. These two answers are the same. Let's solve more exercise. Example number 12. Running rental charge $25. You have to read the question well. Plus $15. Per hour. Per means multiply. For one hour, he gets $15. For one hour. To rent a chain so David rented the chain so for five hours. This is the third number. Write an expression. First, it will be like that. $25 plus he rents this so for $15 per hour. And he rented it for five hours. Per means multiply. I told you before. So it will be like that. 15 multiply five. Number 13. 14. Students bought their art teacher a new easel for $129 and a set of blank canvases for $46. Sales tax was $10.50. Again, we have 14 students bought their art teacher a new easel for $129, the first one they bought. And set of blank canvases for 40 cents. Second one they bought, and they paid tax, was 10.50. So we have to add them all first, like that, $129 plus $46, plus $10.50. This is the money they paid. After that, they shared the cost equally. Shared equally means the divide. Shared equally, equally means the divide. So we need to divide this money among 14 students because they share this money together. Let's see another exercise. <clears throat> Number 17. 
which expression represent the following calculation subtract means minus 214 from you have to pay attention about this word from subtract means minus no problem the number which after from will be the first uh, sorry will be this first yes after from will be the first so 700 21 is the first number from 214 so write 214 here that's the translation of the first expression subtract 214 from 720 and then then means bracket divide by 5 so after that divided by 5 so our answer is 721 minus 215 divided by 5 will be D. Number 18. Last winter, Kofi earned 47.50 dollars. Shoveling snow and 122 dollars giving ice skating. So he earned two numbers. Lessons. During the summer, he earned twice as much by doing the hard work. Which expression shows how you could calculate the amount of money coffee earned during the summer? First, we are going to add these two numbers like that. 47 plus 122. This is the money he earned. After that, twice. Twice means multiply by two. So you have to put these two numbers inside the bracket. Twice means multiply by two. It's like the word double. If you have double and twice, they are the same. Multiply by two. So it will be 47.50 plus 122 inside bracket times two. So the answer will be letter C. Let's solve more exercise. Here, number one, we have Multiply 16, 3, and 29. We need to multiply these three numbers like that. 16 times 3 times 29. Then, then we need brackets. Then this word, subtract 17. So it will be minus 17. Add means a plus, add means a plus, 13.2 and 0 0.9. So 13.2 plus 0 0.9. Then the word then we need bracket. Then divide by 0 0.6. Subtract, subtract 12 and a half from, from the first, the number after from is will be the first. Subtract means minus 12 and a half from, so you have to write here 12 and a half in the second part. What about the first part? From the product, product means times, product means times of 9 over 10 and 180 it will be like that 9 over 10 times 180 because product means times you can put these two numbers inside bracket no problem number four add the quotient add the quotient add means a plus 
quotient means the divide of 120 and 62. So first you have to make 120 divided by 60. This is the quotient of 120 divided by 60. Two, it means plus, because add, add related to two. Add this word should with two. You can put them inside bracket. So the other quotient is 72 and the nine. 72 quotient means the divide divided by 9. Multiply 71 by 8. 71 times 8. And then, then means plus. So it will be plus, sorry, it will be add, no problem. And then means bracket. Add 379. Find three times the difference. I told you before, three times the difference means three times open bracket. And inside the bracket minus. Three times the difference of 7.25 minus 4.5. Now we finished our lesson. I hope you understood this lesson well. Please don't forget your online assignment. It will start at 9.30 9 a.m. and end at 9.30 p.m. Don't miss this time. Thank you. Have a nice day.